For question two, you are going to be transitioning from your prototype sketch to your final laser engraved artwork. Use this presentation as a resource to complete this activity. So if we take a look at the presentation, you're going to be taking a laser engraved horse and you're going to be redrawing your artwork from your prototype sketch onto this larger version. Note that the cardboard version is, is a lot bigger um, than your prototype sketch, so you need to increase the scale or the size of your images as well. Once you're done redrawing your imagery onto the cardboard horse, large filling the space and anchor it, meaning extending off the page with overlap, you're going to be outlining in black marker. Next, take an eraser and erase all unnecessary pencil marks. Next, fill in the objects in the foreground. Primarily use marker if possible and use a consistent color scheme. Note that I've used blues, reds, and yellows throughout my images here. Then move on to the background. When you're working on your background, try using colored pencils or oil pastels to make sure that that background is lighter and maybe even a little bit more faded to emphasize the images in the foreground. That allows your artwork to create some contrast and layering to show what's closer and what's further away. When your artwork is completed, take a photo of it and insert it into the right column here.